Yeah, God bless you all my friends. Happy New Year once again. I want to officially invite us to our midnight prayers on my new YouTube channel, Minister Ngozi Dograna, every 12 o'clock midnight Nigeria time. Minister Ngozi Dograna. When you go to YouTube, you type Minister Ngozi Dograna. You subscribe. Subscription is free. They don't have um there's no money applied to it. You don't remove any of them. Just for you to get notification when we are live, you know, on live every 12 o'clock midnight, Nigerian time. This year, don't just be sleeping around and telling you we need to pray. The Bible says we should pray without ceasing. I discovered that majority of us we are lazy when it comes to prayer. We prefer prophecy, let people prophesy to us. That is why. Well. Majority of us force victims to scammers. Many of my followers will tell me, Mama, I send money to one place like that. You know, they ask me for money before they pray for me. I say it's not me, and you know it that I don't um, ask for money for prayers. You know why you fall victim? Because you are lazy in the area of prayers. So they are taking advantage of, of that. They are really taking advantage of that to you know, to maneuver, how would I put it? They are taking advantage of it because they know you don't want to pray. And you want miracle. Please sit up. This year is not a year you just sit up and you are waiting for manna to fall from heaven. Jesus prayed. Elijah, we are, you know, asking that we want to God of Elijah send that fire. Everybody is shouting God of Elijah. He prayed. The Bible says in the book of James, Elijah was a man like us. He prayed. That it will, there will be no rain. And there was no rain. He prayed again. Let there be rain. And there was rain. So I'm employing you to join. When you come to my comment session, you see so many prayer requests. Mommy, pray for me, pray, 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 pray. I am praying, but let me tell you also, there is power in agreement prayers. The Bible says when two more are gathered in his name, he is there. And then he says, we shall declare and say, we shall be established. So God knows the power of unity in prayers. If one person will move one thousand, two will move more, even three will move more. So try the midnight prayer. Don't be lazy this year. And you are just saying, God, I'm not, ah, God, you are blessing others, you are not blessing me. God, you are blessing others, you are not blessed. Nobody will force you this time around. When God answers the prayer, it's you, it's not your prayer, you are the one that will benefit from it, not me. I'm encouraging you to pray this season. I am just encouraging you to join in our prayer platforms, especially the midnight prayers. In the stand of the on our YouTube channel. When you are coming, come with your prayer, my children, and say that I trust in God for the fruits of the womb. Come with your baby clothes, you are trusting God for marriage. You come with your wedding ring or, or, or wedding gown. You are trusting God for your visa. You come with prayer contacts, you know, something you use. If it's your business area, you are trusting God for contract, you are trusting God in any financial breakthrough. Come with your business materials. You are trusting God for healing. You come with anointing or you know water. I am trusting God that as we join our faith together in prayers, heaven will hear us. You will have testimony. You will have your own miracle. Before the first quarter of the sea, before the first quarter of the sea, the Lord will turn your imagination into reality. The Lord will turn your imagination into reality. God will turn your imagination into reality. God will turn your imagination into reality in the name of Jesus. What? The ball is left in your court. Will you play or will you leave it? God has given you an open chair of prayer. If you are in a, you know, I'm, I'm how I put it in a football field. And the fellow footballer passed uh, the ball to you. If you refuse to keep to the net, 
then you will not score goal. You will not expect God to you know, come from heaven and be the one that will kick the ball. You are the one that will make the move. God has given you all the ability. God has given you every necessary thing you need to do to achieve your testimony. So it's left for you to assess and run along with it. Or you keep on sleeping and waiting for someone you will blame. You blame your father, you blame your uncle, you blame your aunt, you blame everybody around you. You blame your pastor, you blame everyone. But what are you doing? Arise. And I'm telling you, when you arise, you will shine. You don't see that to shine. As you arise in prayers, as you arise in living a holy life, I declare God Almighty will cause you to shine. Your prayers will be answered in Jesus' name. I'm expecting you tonight, every 12 o'clock midnight, Nigeria time, on our YouTube channel, and it's time for you to pray for amen prayers. As you join us, only on my view. I will turn your imagination into reality. In the name of God the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. In Jesus' name. Amen and amen. God bless.